Oh my gosh, what are you doing? Poppy, why are you naked? Poppy, no! Put some clothes on. What did you do? Why? Before we get into today's episode, I really quick want to say a big thank you to our sponsor, Ludia Inc. Ludia Inc. makes this amazing game, which I'm low key obsessed with lately, ever since I downloaded it, called Loveling. It's an interactive narrative in which you can choose your own dating story. It kind of feels a little bit like those dating apps, but you don't have to deal with like real people. You get to deal with like awesome characters. As you can see, I've already got some uh, profiles to swipe on. I played it a little bit already. I want to open this profile. Hugo Hornsby. I'm kind of like a great slice of pizza. Warm and delicious. You always want more of me. I want to swipe left on this one. <gasps> and then there's Skylar Quinn. I'm not the guy you take home to your parents. I'm the guy you can't get enough of. <laughs> 10 out of 10. We'll swipe right. <gasps> it's a match. Let's chat now with Skylar Quinn. I can say hi or give a kissy emoji. I want to be extra flirty. Let's go kissy emoji. <laughs> <laughs> he said two exclamation points. While you're chatting with your matches, you can make choices in the conversation that will lead you onto different paths. Starting strong, Skylar. I agree, he is starting pretty strong. You must get that opening all the time. Uh, yeah, I render all my matches speechless or most people write, you know, words. I'm gonna say, yeah, I render all my matches speechless. I like to go in with confidence. Ooh, he liked my text. <laughs> I have some other matches I've been talking to. My favorite of my matches is of course, Antoine Dawson. He's doing like a dog sledding thing right now. It's kind of cute. He's a vegetarian and it says, I'm looking to expand my horizons. I want to go on adventures. I love hiking, exploring distant places and challenging my own limits. Sounds like someone I could get along with. We had like a very cute convo earlier. Ooh, but he just texted me. I'm gonna text him back. He said, hello. And I said, you're alive. And he said, yeah, I survived day one of the race. Literally we texted like a couple days ago and then he texted me back like recently. And if you hate waiting, there's this blow kiss feature. You can blow a little kiss and make your match uh, kind of come back and chat with you again. You can also go on a date with these gentlemen. It's not just texting. And the lovely date feature lets you experience fun little adventures with your matches. Okay, he just sent me like a spicy pic, Antoine did, and it's him shirtless with his dog. <laughs> I also have another match, Jamie Grant, who is into gaming. There is over 85 different characters with different personalities and different stories. The options are endless. If you download the game this week, you will also receive 100 bonus gems on top of your starter gems, which really helps you get started. So don't miss out, the offer ends September 27th, 2021. What's up everybody? I'm Kelsey and I love colorful things. So I decided to try the Not So Berry Challenge. It's a challenge at The Sims 4 where you have one family, but you play for 10 generations and each generation is themed after a different color. We're wrapping up the final episode of the Rose Gen. So let me just get some beautiful like aesthetic. Okay, it's not that bright because it's daylight outside, but once I get my blinds put in, it's gonna look a lot better. It's the last episode of the Rose Gen because our lovely daughter Summer is aging up into a teen in this episode, but technically last episode would normally be what I would choose to be the last episode, but last episode was kind of a bummer town. So I want to set up my Rose Gen for success. I want her to feel a little bit better placed before we move on, but we will also be focusing a lot on the Yellow Gen in this episode as well because she's going to be a teen. So we'll finally get to really dig in to her generation, but I will be listing and announcing all of the things that are requirements of her generation next episode. All right, we're back with Poppy. It is a Thursday morning and she do be feeling a little gross and nauseous. She did have a drink, but you know, it's okay. We've got our lovely sweet baby angel Rosie here and our young baby girl Summer, who is raring to go. I did go CC shopping for Summer's future teen outfits. If you're interested in those, go check it out on my second channel, More Kelsey Future K, and make sure to go subscribe there. Also subscribe here if you haven't already, click that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, you're notified every time a new video goes up, which I put up new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. We are so close. So the only two things that we need to do left for Poppy's gen is have our finish this aspiration, which is like just two more boyfriends and then marry when we're an elder. I'm not gonna wait to finish this challenge as we're an elder. Her story will obviously just keep continuing on, but right now Poppy is not feeling too hot 
god she does have work in four hours but she's not really like doing much i honestly feel like poppy maybe it's time you take a mental health day you know you're a hard worker you're already at level 10 i know you're like the national leader but even national leaders i'm sure at some point get a day off granted she does get three days off throughout the week but i just feel like she just went through a really bad like life thing so let's take a vacation day all right that way she can take a time at home get to know her maybe new bae meanwhile of course our sweet baby angel summer is doing her homework she ages up i believe tomorrow yep tomorrow is her birthday oh on love day and then we'll have the weekend to kind of vibe and uh, get to know our new girl so much to do i'm so excited we're gonna focus on our homework so we only have like two days left of school because we have today and tomorrow left of school poppy's not feeling too well she did take her day off so why don't you go like sleep off your your drink oh yeah she's upset she's crying oh i don't blame her but you know having a cocktail in the morning if you're gonna take off work it's no big deal sure we've all done it at least once you have a cocktail in the morning with breakfast that's just brunch so why don't you go check on your kitty well let's spend some quality time with our sweet elder rosie we're a little dazed from drink but and we just lost a celebrity level oh but that's you know what that's probably for the best let's calm down rosie let's give her lots of hugs and pets oh sweet that's so cute summer's homework is complete good job summer do you need to do your extra credit why don't you go ahead and do your extra credit too do you have anything else you need to do she's already like crushed that she already is working on logic because she's just so smart she's already with like one adult skill which is amazing poppy and her kitty are having a lovely time feel the love maybe take a little nap on the couch just have a nice like off day poppy sometimes you need to have a mental health day you can't just work and work yourself to death and maybe that's like a good learning that she can learn out of this bad experience in her life you know all work and no play makes poppy a dull sim and we got summer finishing up her skills she's so cute oh i'm so proud of her poppy should like have a little fun date maybe today with her boyfriend maybe in or a future boyfriend she's technically not dating him yet we'll invite him over it's gonna be great. Oh, she wants to do sit-ups. Oh my gosh. Can you do that? I want her to do sit-ups. How do you do that? Do sit-ups. Exercise. I want to watch her do that. Go ahead. Go ahead, girl. Do your sit-ups. Maybe do some, do some push-ups. She can do exercises. Look how cute she is. She likes it. Oh, look at her go. Okay, go off, queen. Oh, and look, she's got push-ups now. She's like, you know, astronauts need a fit body in order to be in space. So when I be an astronaut to go to my home, home world someday i need to start doing that because i'm gonna make grandma proud i'm gonna see the same spaceships that she saw when she was abducted by aliens but this time i'm going on my own volition oh and she, summer's gonna sit at least in the same room as mom i think they just are gonna have like back and forth like just a little bit of not bad relationships but like kind of like just not good necessarily vibes she's gonna go she's gonna nag her daughter a little bit be like i know you want to go you know be an astronaut but i think you should just like focus on what we have here see look at her she's kind of having a moment with her daughter okay she's taking a nap and summer's going but yeah i'm slowly but surely trying to work their relationship down and haru's up but it's it's hard i think they just naturally do kind of get along i mean they only have each other you know but we're gonna listen to teachers so we have extra lessons i have a mod which you can check out on my patreon i have a mod that actually like she learns stuff in school while she's studying i think it's the kawaii stacy better schools mod so she actually like learns skills while at school oh lionel hey babe you busy no i'm not busy i was just having a nap relaxing you know having a mental day off after my father's death so let's uh let's have some fun oh there he is okay hang out with lover hopefully he sticks around although it is his house so i don't know where he would go if he left oh okay maybe you should ask him to be your boyfriend just like right away be my boyfriend i think she just doesn't want to be alone right now and he's fine i don't blame her she's still a little a little tipsy for the next couple of minutes she is emboldened to invite him and boom we got seven of eight boyfriends <laughs> nailed it okay let's check out his apartment it's kind of fun i like this like little setup here this is nice oh and then he's got it does this is upstairs oh okay he's got a pretty nice looking apartment here all right why don't you sit together watch the tv together oh he scooted over towards her 
her. Oh, I was being very flirty with Poppy. Be enticing to him and look deeply into his eyes. She's having a very good day off of work, you know, doing her favorite thing, flirting and... That's about it. Flirting and work are kind of Poppy's favorite things, but they're having a good, a good little snuggle, little moment. He's got some beautiful green eyes. Oh, look at them. Cozy, cozy. Her makeup's like clipping into her skin a little. I don't like that. Since Summer's going to be a teen soon, we're gonna have to give Poppy a different makeover so she, they don't look so close in age. She's probably nearing 40 is my guess. She's not an elder, but I feel like she's probably nearing 40. That is my guess. I feel like by the time you're an elder, you're like 60, 70. So she's probably like 40 years old right now. She's like, I'm gonna use your restroom. Oh, hey, I heard you became friends with Summerberry. She's pretty cool. Oh my God, look at the muscles on her legs. Did you see that? Oh my gosh, look at the muscles on Poppy's legs. Is that both from yoga? I mean, I knew Poppy was ripped. I just forgot, to be honest. Oh, she's feeling a headache now because she's sobering up. Maybe you should get some glass of water, girl. Go get some water, get some, hydrate yourself after your little cocktail morning. Yeah, no more drinking. I made a fool of myself. She didn't like that about herself. I love that for her. She's growing, she's learning, you know? She's like, you know what? I didn't really like being drunk in front of my loved ones in the morning. Like that felt wrong. And now she's just chilling with her lover. How long is this happening for? I think we should go home. Let's go home. We had a nice afternoon with our, our bae. Oh, he's a little broken hearted that we're gonna go. We're like, um, my daughter's gonna be home from school soon. And although like I'm not super close with her and I nag her a lot, I still love her. And I don't want her to chill at home by herself. It's the last night of summer being a kid. Oh my gosh, what are you doing? Poppy, why are you naked? Poppy, no! Put some clothes on. What did you do? Why? Poppy, put your clothes back on, please. Please, Poppy. What a free spirit our Poppy is. Oh, I can't. You know, okay, this is weird. This is weird. I need you to go practice some yoga. Put your clothes on, girl. I can't. I can't do this. Unless she's gonna do yoga in the nude. Okay, no, she's not. Good. Okay, so Poppy's doing her yoga. She's doing a bit of like self centering and summer is gonna go oh my gosh summer is gonna go take a bath in poppy's bath again which i feel like poppy's gonna get mad at which will crack me up so we gotta do that we gotta get, let summer go take a, another bath in mom's jacuzzi and when mom catches her she's gonna be like stop it i told you no i told you not to get in my jacuzzi also it could be dangerous arguably look at those abs she is so ripped meanwhile summer is having a phenomenal time in mom's jacuzzi Living the dream. Final day of being a kid. She's getting sassy. All right, I want you to kind of catch your daughter and kind of yell at her. So she's like, Summer, why are you in my tub? I told you not to use my tub once before. Oh, their relationship is pretty low. Argue about house rules. Oh, she's not liking mom right now. She's like, the house rule is that you don't use mom's bathroom, okay? Oh my gosh, Summer. Summer's gonna argue back. She's gonna be like, that's a dumb rule, mom. I'm almost a teenager now. And Poppy's like, but it is my tub, okay? And I do not want you in it. And those are my rules. Why don't you? Oh, she's really angry. She's so fuming. And Poppy's like, oh, I'm fine. Oh, she came back around to yell at mom. They are not vibing right now. Oh my goodness. Sentiments of summer hurt sentiment. Oh yeah, they have some hurt and, and grudges and stuff. My neighbor has been really loud lately and has ruined my sleep. Should I just call the cops and then? No. Also, why are you calling me? Go talk to your wife. Get out. Stop talking, stop arguing. Poppy, why don't you cool off with some more yoga? Uh, listen, are you always this stupid or are you just- Oh, rude, who is that? She's writing in her journal. She's calming down a little. She's getting some more emotional control. She is very mad, but she's happier now because she journaled about it. Okay, no, she's mad again. I was like, she's gonna be happy. No, she's not. Maybe because her mom's right over there. She's like annoyed. Ugh. Why don't you give some pets to Rosie? Play with a laser pointer. We do want to kiss someone. Hmm. Oh, and we are we are feeling stinky. Let's take her a bath since we argued over it. Summer's feeling good. She's just like having her, you know, her little logic time. Can I come over and play? Uh 
said no. I'm sorry. I love, but Summer is a loner. I feel like she's all like riled up from being with her mom. She's like, no, I need some alone time to recalibrate my system. I don't want to talk to people right now. So we're playing with Rosie with the laser pointer. Oh, she's so cute. Look at her. You're going to catch it, Rosie. I believe in you. Maybe we'll read under the covers and then sleep. I feel like that sounds like something that we would do. Oh, be called to meal. Mom's calling us to a meal. Maybe Poppy feels a bit guilty about nagging her. And there's trash all over the floor, though. Interesting. Look at that. Look at that. We're going to clean up and then we're going to go off to bed. We're not going to necessarily talk with her, but we did make her dinner. So that was kind of nice. It was like an olive branch but yeah they're not very good friends which is and she's better friends with her dad tomorrow is her birthday so we're gonna have a birthday we'll have to do a makeover a room makeover all the nuts and bolts on her last evening as a kid Poppy is asleep too. Ooh, it's love day. Okay. Why don't we send a little text to Lionel? Happy love day. Good morning kind of thing. Okay. Well, we're going to just chat with Rosie apparently. It's our final day of, of grade school before we go to high school. She's going to be a little freshman. My baby's grown up so fast. Poppy, meanwhile. Ooh, it's taking out the garbage. Good for you, bro. Oh, no. Oh, no. That scared the bejeebus out of me, but it's still really sad. Oh, no. I'm so glad that we got back up and, and said hi to Rosie because Rosie just passed away. You know what? Stay asleep. Stay asleep. Never mind. Don't wake up. Don't wake up. Stay asleep. Oh, my gosh. Poppy's gonna... Poppy's watching TV. No, Poppy, go check this out, okay? You gotta be here. Go see what's happening. Pop Someone's gotta witness this. Rosie's not gonna die alone, okay? Okay. We are going to witness the death. Yes. I mean, poor Poppy, though. She just became happier after her dad's death and on Love Day, no less, which is Poppy's favorite holiday. Poor girl. She got work soon, too. Bye, Rosie. You were a good cat. You were the best cat. We loved you. I'm gonna put Rosie in our inventory. She'll be with us all the time, and we're going into work, and uh, Summer's gotta go to school, so. Summer, have fun at your final day at school. She's sad. She woke up and she knew. She woke up and she knew that something had happened. Also, the Grim Reaper in her bathroom might have been like a dead giveaway. <laughs> Pun. I drew you a picture. Want to see it? Okay. Uh, at least, uh, you know, the kids at school are being nice. Jordan seems to want to be her friend. Let's uh, listen to teacher today. Make sure to get our skills up. And Poppy's going to be working hard. All right. Oh, Summer leveled up with creativity and with uh, her motor skill. Oh, Poppy needs to provide tough feedback to a coworker. How should you give the news? Straighten on Honest. That's our poppy's way. School flower fundraiser. In honor of Love Day, summer school always allows students to buy flowers to be delivered to each other during class. With some money to spend, Summer decided to take advantage of the fundraiser and celebrate the holiday. Buy flowers for everyone in class. I feel like she is shy and she's more introverted and she is also not very social. She doesn't really want to hang out with other people. However, she wouldn't just buy things for herself. She's also a little softy. So Summer decided to surprise the entire class with flowers while Sitting in math, each flower was hand delivered, taking enough time to get them out of a test. I feel like Summer would like like a test because she's like her Hermione, but ooh, logic level six. Good job, queen. Here we go. We are in a raise and Summer is an excellent A student. Summer, why don't you go take a nap? Okay, Poppy is going to make you a little cake. A matcha tea cake would be cute. Let's do a matcha tea cake. That sounds nice. I feel like that would be tasty. Let's invite Lionel over. We'll give him like flowers and stuff while we get this cake going for our daughter's birthday. Oh, there's our boyfriend. Give a love day gift. Let's buy a rose and give him a rose. Live love day gift of a rose. Be like, here you go. Here's a rose. It's by generation. And then she'll put birthday candles on top. He's like, I bought you a rose for love day. I hope you like it. He did. He did like it. That's very sweet. She completed one love day thing, but she's she's not in the mood to really be flirting. Oh, not even in the mood to be flirty. Why don't you give yourself a little pep talk, queen? That sucks though. It's so hard to lose a pet. I'm so sorry for her. She wants to write in her journal. Wait, that's true. We did have a journal back in the day. Why don't you go uh, write in your journal? Okay, we're gonna throw a party after we write in our journal. Summer is up as well. She wants to grab a serving, but I think before that, why don't we have both girls write in journals? So that way we're gonna have a little more fun with the party. It's okay, girls. I'm sorry. I hope you feel better. Oh, she's so upset. Poor sweetie. But then after that, we're going to plan a birthday 
party. Morning pet and morning losing a friend and morning. Lionel, why are you calling us to go on a date? We're literally right here. He's not the sharpest pencil in the box, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but it's a birthday party! And Summer, I know Summer's feeling really bummed out, so maybe, I know we were gonna give her this rocket ship for her birthday, but I'm thinking, since she loves gaming, we could get her a cute little gaming console system where she can play it with her family members, which I think would be really cute. So, okay, so we're gonna grab this. Ooh, it's yellow too. All right, and then we're gonna, ooh, we could put it right in front of the TV. That could be fun, but we're gonna put it right here there you go and now when everyone comes over she can play video games with everybody oh and then hunter's here go get to know hunter all other siblings are here oh my gosh poppy is ripped oh my goodness and mom is making out with her boyfriend as everyone arrives that sounds about right look at the gang is all here though look at them all yeah get to know with everybody give a big hug to dad thank him for coming girl what what? Who is? Who ate that? Who took a slice of cake? How did you do that, Poppy? Can we not? Also, wait. Who is? What? Elise is pregnant with whose baby? Oh my gosh! Celebrate her pregnancy. Everybody is chaotic. Also, we need to use the restroom. It looks like Mom ate a bit of our cake, but it's I guess okay because the candles are still on there, so we can still do it. Oh, but Elise, congratulations! We're celebrating Elise. Elise, are you? Did you get married or are you just having a baby? Oh, she's married to Dana Cotter. We did flirt a little bit with Dana, but we didn't flirt a ton with Dana. Good for you. Okay, no, Haru still doesn't have a, a spouse and he only has one child, which is our child. Okay, I'm just checking. Oh, and then let's let's play video games together. Why don't you play a multiplayer game? Play, play, play Party Frenzy with Jade Forest and Haru. She's like, okay, I'm gonna go. She's a little sad still. Poor little bean. Oh, look at you. Jade loves gaming too, but they're gonna bond over that. That's very sweet. Poppy's still bummed out. Why don't you complain? about your problems a little bit. Oh my gosh, are you okay, Hunter? Oh, are they having an argument? Oh no, she's complaining about her problems. Apparently he was okay with it. Ask baby's due date. That's so cool though, she's pregnant. Also, I wanna check out this fam squad playing some games. So cute. I love it. I love when the fam all gets together and hangs out. This is the perfect gift for her. She gets to spend quality time, but she doesn't have to like talk to people as much. I feel like it's exactly what we wanted for her. Poppy, why don't you go grab don't eat the cake just grab some food okay why don't you eat that matcha cake okay just eat the slice oh my gosh summer's feeling better that is so cute i love it oh and she's giving a hug to forest that's so sweet discuss fractions why don't you talk more with jade i really want her and jade to get along we're uh making some silly faces Let's just keep chatting with everybody a little bit. Oh, she likes fitness and gaming. Summer, I don't know if she likes fitness yet, but she does love gaming. So they have that in common. All right, and now I think it is time to celebrate. Go celebrate. Blow out your candles, queen. Oh, the candles are floating because everyone ate the cake before she could do this. Hunter is helping her blow out the candles. There we go. Happy birthday. Summer aged up. Okay, so she's gonna be clumsy. The yellow generation's aspiration is the nerd brain. So there you have it. And let's check her out in Creative Sim. I'm so excited to give her a makeover. Okay, so here is Summer Berry. I think there's potential there. I think there is potential with the Sim, but she does look a right mess right now. So let's take off her hair. Let's start with her brows. They look honestly chaotic. I downloaded a ton of hairs and it's super hard to choose, but I think I'm gonna go with this one. I just want her to have like soft girl vibes and she's gonna be, you know, building rockets and going into space. She might be more into some, some pants. Yo, I love it. I love it. Love, 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 love. Okay, formal wear. Oh my goodness, beautiful. Look how cute she is. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Okay, and then athletic. There you have it. She was like a fitness watch. I love that. That's cute. How cute is this top? I love that with the purple. 
I love her style. She's so cute. So this is Summer Berry. I love her to pieces. I can't believe she's already a teen. I'm so shook. And then of course there is Poppy. Maybe we should give Poppy like a bit of just something in her face details, you know? Like we'll just do this. She's still rocking the same look though. I don't think I would change that look from her. I might change this one. This is kind of cute. It's giving me, I don't know what energy, but I kind of like it. It's kind of mature and like fashionable. This one, I feel like maybe this one might be better. Oh, I like that actually. Oh, I love this for her. Okay, I don't like these pants with it unless it was like more of a, like a nude or something. I like this. Okay, this is slowly coming together or maybe like a denim. That's pretty. Okay, I'm liking this more and more as we go. All right, and then we do like a nude shoe since she has a nude top. I like this new outfit. I really like this a lot. I liked this one, even though they're kind of two different colors. This is cute on her, actually. I like this look. I like this look a lot. I'm gonna do this, and then the rest of it, I think, is good to go. I think the rest of it is good. But we got a new, a bit of a new look for Poppy and a new look for Summer. It's perfect! Yay! I love it so much! Also, it means it's time for a makeover for her bedroom! Oh, yeah, they're still sad. Oh, I forgot. And Summer's sad, too, but she looks so... So cute. I love her outfit. Go give your dad a hug. I feel like Haru needs maybe like a little update at some point too. But before you go to bed, we'll give you a little room makeover. Oh, she needs to go. Okay, why don't you go to use the toilet now? Just chatting with dad as usual. Oh, they're so, they're like two peas. He's so proud of her. You could just tell. Poppy's just vibing on computer. Did it break? Oh my gosh, it broke. Great. Well, let's just repair that. And let's really fast before she goes to bed, let's make her bedroom more like sensible. Oh my gosh. What would teen Summer actually want in her bedroom? Well, this she's too big for this now. So we're gonna delete that. We're gonna delete the toys, I think, cause she's just a little too old for it. She can, maybe we'll give the Poppy doll into P mom's office since she's gonna want to remind herself of her mom anyway. I want stuff that gives me more of her energy. I do like all of this under here though. I think that could all probably stay. That makes sense for her. Maybe like a bookcase in her room might be good. We'll do like a little cozy reading area. This one's nice. Have her kind of give a little area to like read and research and be a nerd. Wallpaper, I think I want something different for her walls. We could do something more like soft colored. It looks like a little childish, but I think that, that makes a lot of sense. Cute. Oh, that's so cozy. Oh, I love these. They're like so like gauzy. I love that. Okay, those are cute. I'm loving how cozy this room is starting to feel. It's perfect. Maybe we'll do a little alien guy over here because she likes alien stuff. I like this little guy over here in this little area. We'll have like one there. You could have like the twinkly lights. That's cute. We could even put this under the window if we actually wanted to. We'll slot it in there actually. The backpack. I feel like that makes the most sense here. I think it's done. I think that looks great. All right, why don't you go to sleep, birthday girl? She's like cleaning up. Summer, happy birthday. Everyone's headed home. Go spend time with your dad really fast before he heads out. Aw, they're so cute. And she's feeling extra playful. Oh, and now we can buy her like books for her skills. If we could buy her like rocket science and handiness and all that stuff. Let's do like a logic and then a rocket science. Or do we already have the rocket science one? We already have the rocket science one. Perfect. Ooh, maybe we should read it upstairs to new reading nook bedroom area. Ooh, girl, let's go. Go, go, go. Love that, because we got to finish reading three books. Actually, she's really tired. Oh, you can read tomorrow, sweetie. Why don't you go to bed? I love her bedroom. It is perfect. I love it so much. Good night. Love day is over. It was pretty good. Oh, well, good. I'm glad it was okay. And Poppy's getting her, getting her life together a little bit. You know, she's vibing this guy, even if he's kind of not the best, like he's okay. Oh, Haru's still here. It's like he should just move in with them, but I think it would complicate things a little bit if you moved in with them. Although I guess 
Summer could actually move in with Haru, but we're not done with Poppy, so I don't think we should. Okay, he's gotta go. The house is dark. Look at this. Ooh, Poppy's up. Oh, she's feeling great, feeling confident. She's gonna go get some food. Oh, she's getting a piece of cake. Cake for breakfast. Love that. She wants to go for a jog. Okay, you can go for a jog. She's gonna go jogging with the cake. Are you kidding? In that outfit? Going jogging with the cake in that outfit. Okay, at least she's going jogging with the cake in a different outfit. And Summer's awake. She's got her little face mask on, making sure that her skin's all good for school. Ooh, she wants to level up her handiness skill. All right, I got a thing for you. Mom's having a good time in her jacuzzi. We're gonna get in here and level up our handiness skill by working on the toilet. There you go. Mom's gonna go grab more cake. Mom, why don't you just cook you guys some lunch or something? Sir some brunch. Let's do some eggs and toast. She's working hard at fixing this. She is also hungry. Ooh, she's feeling festering bitterness from somewhere nearby. She just like does not like her mom. <laughs> Summer, no! It had to happen, but I hate it. I hate it that they're not like close. She's setting the table for them for brunch. Okay, grab a serving of your brunch. There she goes though. They're both sitting in the formal dining room. She's bored and she feels annoyed because mom's here. <sighs> Poppy! Okay. Okay, Poppy, why don't, it's a Saturday. So why don't you invite your boyfriend over, Lionel? Lionel is an adorable himbo. I think Poppy would get bored over time with Lionel. <laughs> Summer, why don't you, like, oh, you could do your homework today. That would be cute. But you could also read. She's up here reading in her little book. Oh, it's so cozy. Oh, I love it. Ooh, is she getting her first book? Oh, wait, there's a new, some, a festival of snow has started. How cute is that? Maybe we should go. You know what? I feel like she's call her dad and be like, dad, let's go to the festival of snow, but like not invite mom. <laughs> So let's invite Haru and go to the Festival of Snow. I did not finish that book. We have plenty of time to work on that aspiration. We're here. Oh, we're in our little outfit too. Oh, why is he embarrassed? Are you okay? Let's check on Haru. Dad, are you okay? Why are you so embarrassed? Maybe he wanted to invite Poppy and she was like, no, she's with her boyfriend. Don't invite her. Summer is fully getting into that teen angst vibe, but it's the winter festival with dad in Kemba. Out Comer Baby. Well, oh, she's taking a shower in the onsen. That's cute. Look at her cute little outfit. Is dad going into the onsen? He's gonna relax in the hot springs. Well, I guess we'll do that together. Whatever you want, dad. Oh my gosh. Look at that. That's some father and daughter spa day. Oh, and she needs to pee. Go, go pee, girl. Go pee. Show off your muscles. You are like very strong, girl. Look at you. You're after your mom there. Pretty muscular. She's telling him this very exciting story. Why don't you two go get some food? together. I feel like that would be so cute. They're not that hungry though. Are there any other like things they could do? Why don't they go a little snow pal together in the, in the center of the little festival area? Oh look, it's another alien skinned kid. That's kind of cool. All right, where's dad? Help me with this dad. It's getting kind of late. Oh, there he is. Oh wow. Oh my gosh, are there fireworks? That is cool. She's feeling very inspired. Talk to your dad about your dreams of going to space. I bet he's supportive them. They're very close. They're good friends. Oh, it'd be cute if they became best friends. Oh, she's really happy spending time with her dad. Oh, maybe get a photo. All right, we're gonna go get a selfie with this character. Look at my sweet summer child. It looks like this is about wrapped up, so she's gonna probably head home and go check in with Poppy, who is probably like a little hurt that she didn't get invited. Summer's not that tired, and I feel like maybe she'll not really wanna go home. So what if I just had her go on a little jog? Cause she needs to start like being athletic for being an astronaut. So it'd be kind of fun. Oh my God, that's such a random cat. Maybe she's like a more of a nighttime workout person. I'm more of a morning time workout person, or maybe she's a little bit of both. Maybe she does both. Poppy's chilling, she's playful. Oh, Poppy's gonna do her own little workout this evening. She's gonna go on her own, do some yoga. I love this for you, Poppy. She's got her own mind body journey. She's on a journey of wellness and we love this for her. I feel like maybe this is kind of maybe the moment that she's kind of realizing like, maybe I don't really wanna be with Lionel. Maybe he's not really for me. So maybe she'll invite him over and be like, listen, Lionel, it's been really fun, but I just feel like we're not the right match. They don't have a lot in common. Now that she's kind of getting 
feeling more confident and more like balanced, she's just like, that's not what I want. You know, I had my fun. I sowed my wild oats, but now I'm more interested in other things. So she's going to ask just to be friends. And I think I want Poppy to be single for a little while. Like she enjoyed, you know, being flirty and jumping from relationship to relationship, but she just doesn't want it anymore. Oh my gosh. Can you leave? Summer's going to like find him in her bathroom and be like, leave go home. And he's now going home. Good. Let's read the rocket science book. Maybe she'll want to read the book before she starts on her rocket so she knows what she needs to do to begin. Look at how happy she is. She's like, I went to a festival. I'm reading a rocket book. I love my life. Even mom is getting some good stuff going on. I love this for her. Good job, Poppy. Our little feisty mama. Ooh, whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh, she almost nailed it though. That was close. That was really close. She almost got that back bend. Acquire the rocket science skill. I love these two independent feisty women curious about clubs speaking of clubs i think we're gonna cancel the alien club i think that was more like a kids thing that they ended up doing for just a little bit and i just don't see summer being like the type to want to be the head of any club she's more of a loner she kind of likes it that way she loves her books and she'll make friends along the way but i don't think she'd want to do anything as intense as a club yay we finished our first book of three i love it oh and poppy's enjoying herself in her little jacuzzi after a nice yoga yoga sesh. Come on, level two of the rocket science skill. Yes. Good job. She can build an upgrade faster. She is going to clean up a bit. And is it time to go to bed yet? She's a little tired. Yeah, she could go to bed. Go use the toilet though. Once you're done, it looks like someone pranked her toilet. It's probably mom's ex went after she broke up with him, pranked her daughter's toilet. This is a good reason why we broke up with him. I know a pranked toilet when I see him. I lived with mint. <laughs> Yep, there it is. What does she want to do? Oh, she wants to do sit-ups. Okay. Handy to skill level two. We did it. Good job. She also wants to level up her logic skill. Ah, I love Summer. She's such a nerd. She's making sure her bathroom's all clean. Oh, it's summertime. Summer, it's summer. She's doing her sit-ups like a boss. Why don't you go to sleep, my darling? It's time. Summer's going to bed. Good night, Summer. And Poppy's doing more yoga this morning. She's an addict. We love this for you. Summer is asleep and Poppy is feeling a lot more centered, a lot more confident in herself on like a full new journey. And I love this for her. I'm so proud of her. And I'm really excited to see where the journey still takes Poppy. There's definitely more still to go. We have to have our final boyfriend and then we will be getting married at some point. So Poppy is going to settle down. I think our final boyfriend will be also like the one that we end up marrying. So I want to give her a little bit of space in between all of her kind of dad alliances and the true one true pairing kind of take our time with that and meanwhile we'll be focusing next episode on summer we'll be officially in the yellow generation and i'll explain everything that that entails in the next episode but thank you guys so much for tuning in and if you're interested make sure to check out love link you can receive a bonus of 100 gems on top of your starter gems until so make sure to go check it out before then you can download it for free using google play or the app store in the link in my description thanks guys